I think at one time or another we've all questioned as to whether all that we see and, and are experiencing in our world has some sort of a rational plan behind it because we understand now that both the Republican and the Democratic Party in our country are basically run by the same people, the same money finances both sides. We now know, of course, through the work of many historians who have spent their life working on research to show us that both sides of world conflicts have always been financed by the same people. And as I've said before, there seems to be a a method to the madness going on in the world. We know, of course, that we cannot depend on our leaders. Our leaders are misleaders. There is a science that they're following. They have their own agenda, and it doesn't include you. What your government pays for, it gets. If you are paid to do something for the government, they will extract from you exactly what they have paid for. When we understand that, then we look at universities and schools, government-financed institutions of education, and see the kind of students and the kind of education that's being turned out by these government-financed schools. Logic will tell you that if what is being turned out in those schools was not in accord with what the state and the federal government wanted, then it would change it. The bottom line is that the government is getting what they have ordered. They're getting what they have paid for. They do not want your children to be educated. They do not want you to think too much. That is why our country and our world has become so proliferated with entertainments, mass media, game shows, television shows, amusement parks, drugs, alcohol, and every kind of entertainment to keep the human mind entertained so that you don't get in the way of important people by doing too much thinking. You had better wake up and understand that there are people who are guiding your life and you don't even know it. And all American citizens, I think, have suspected something like this is going on. But we're all too busy trying to stay alive and live our lives. And after all, what can one person do about it? This is the most powerful government the world has ever known. They have, a, they have the ability to get a hold on Adolf Hitler 50 years ago. He had a standing army, the greatest navy, air force, military, secret underworld organizations operating throughout the world. But this government got a hold on Adolf Hitler because it chose to and it wanted to. And if you do not pay your income taxes, they will find you if you go to the Amazon jungle and they will make an example of you. They will find you and they will deal with you and you know it. But for some reason they're unable to get a handle on drugs and the crime in the streets for some reason.